Hello, I would like today to show the Raspberry Pi 5 8 gigs which I ordered from Kanakit. I ordered from the website when it was out of stock and it seems like what they're selling now on the website is better because it has a case with a fan while the, the case I got with a, with a kit doesn't have a cooler but still I'm very happy with this uh, kit. I will show you what I have in this uh, in the kit I ordered from them. Let's get to it. I will lower the camera a bit so we could see the kit in a clear way. So let's see what we got. First of all, I got the charger. This charger is a special charger for Raspberry Pi 5. That it takes Raspberry Pi 5 takes a little bit more voltage, so it has a different uh, charger. I'll plug it in because in a moment we'll plug the Raspberry in. All right. Then I got a memory card. I already put it in the board. The board comes in a box like this. Here is a memory card. So what inside? Because I put it in. What else we got? We got two mini HDMI cables, which are useful if you want to connect two screens. Uh, and I got the case. The case doesn't have active cooler. It's a pretty cool case because it's very small. It's a very small, nice to have, has a nice touch. Let's uh, let's put the raspberry inside it. Okay, so it opens. That's already open actually. So all I need to do to use this board is to take the board, put it the ports are in this direction. So I put the board this way. And now I just need to screw. Also with this kit, it comes with a nice document about the pins. I'll show you. We have this document, which is a nice document with a pinout of the Raspberry Pi. Very useful. Okay, let's screw it on. Um, actually, I should have not screwed it yet. I need to put the cover on top first. So we close the cover from on top. Uh, it has directions. Yeah, this goes here. Hmm. Should have port the board before I put it in because the memory card has a chip here. Okay, got it. Now we could just screw it in. One. the board a little bit yeah okay now we're good okay so this is how the kit looks when it's assembled it holds the board very nicely this is how the ports look from here from here that here we could see the light and we have kind of access to the restart button but you will need a pen or something in order to access the restart so in this case it's nice it's cute but I wouldn't use it for day to day it doesn't have active cooler but I could see that in the newer kits they're already sending uh, case with active cooler so I'm, I'm very happy with this kit uh, I like it in general to buy from Kana uh, because very convenient they have items in stock uh, so this is a review on this kit thanks for watching